So before I let you go, I must ask you about the security guard, the retired Buffalo police officer who stood in the doorway, literally, uh, and exchanged gunfire with this man who killed 10 people yesterday, heroically, probably saved a bunch of lives. What more can you tell us about him? Well, I can tell you he's a hero. Um, we, we, we knew he was a hero before yesterday. He, he's a retired Buffalo police officer, uh, you know, who spent um, the better part of his life defending the citizens of Buffalo. When he retired from the police department, he took a job as a security guard uh, at this top store, uh, a top store that I know well. Um, uh, you know, down the street from the top store is a cigar shop that I frequent. So I'm very familiar with this area uh, and this top store. And he is a hero. Uh, like you said, Willie, uh, he uh, uh, used his weapon yesterday and exchanged gunfire. Uh, again, allegedly, um, the defendant was wearing tactical gear, so, um, mm -hmm. you know, he was not injured. But again, as you said, he is a hero, uh, has been a hero for a number of years uh, in this community. Without question, Erie County District Attorney John Flynn, who has charged the alleged gunman with first degree murder and may, as he says, add hate crimes as we go along in this investigation. Thank you very much for your time this morning, sir. And please send our sympathies and love to your community this morning. We're all feeling for you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.